Hello, today I'm going to explain how to run Monte Carlo uh, with match parameter simulation in using KDN6. Um, the first step is to uh, start uh, our design kit properly. Uh, our target today is to simulate um, one analog buffer. Um, we ran um, a Monte Carlo simulation with it to study the uh, effect of the transistor mismatch on the uh, buffer outputs. So we are going to open the view that we are going to simulate. This uh, is uh, our schematic. Uh, um, we are going to, to run a transient, transient analysis. We have defined a Cine wave input and we will study how the output follows the wave. So we launch the uh, analog design environment and we are going to create, create a new view. So we are going to define first the uh, kind of analysis that we are going to perform. So um, we click here and um, here in the in analysis we specify the analysis that we are going to perform. The default uh, transitory analysis set so we just have to add the um, uh, duration of the analysis we make a short analysis of one microsecond um, um, we are going to run a Monte Carlo simulation so we have to specify the models that we are going to use for the transistor so to this we um, go here and to select the model library that we are going to use. By default, uh, all the devices use the nominal uh, model files that uh, don't uh, have or include this much uh, uh, parameters. But we are going to change it. Um, we are going to add the Monte Carlo models to uh, model the uh, mismatch in transistor and um, capacitor. So we click here and we select the remote Monte Carlo model. So you see that we have changed the models that we are going to use for the capacitor and um, for the uh, transistor. Click OK. And now we select the outputs that we are going to save and plot. We are going to plot the input voltage and the output voltage. We click OK. Now we can go to the uh, our design environment tool. We have here the outputs that we are going to plot. We can also click here to save things. Um, to run um, Monte Carlo simulation, we have to select uh, this option set by the default, single run, sweep, and corner. Um, we have to select the uh, Monte Carlo simulation. We click here, the run, and we select Monte Carlo something. We can make uh, two different uh, simulations related to this match. We can just simulate the component in this match, but we can also simulate the process variation from chip to chip. 
or both of them simultaneously. Um, for simplicity, we just simulate here and uh, the mismatch, um, the impact of the mismatch of this. Here, we uh, selected the number of rounds that we are going to perform. Uh, we are going just to select two to make the process shorter. And the next step is to click here to save the uh, data associated to the integral simulation. Um, it's very important to click here too because uh, we would like to plot all the different um, outputs that we are going to get for each uh, run. We can also click here if we want to specify the devices that we want to include or simulate if it match or not. The default we will simulate it all. So we click OK. Um, and to run the simulation, we just click here on the new button. You can see here the status of the simulation. So, as finished. Um, if we want to plot the results, um, Click here, plot all the way forms. And we can see the input and the output voltage. The input voltage comes from an ideal source, so it doesn't change from simulation to simulation. But if we analyze in detail the output voltage, you see that uh, uh, we have variation from simulation to simulation. So that's all. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Um, uh, please follow our course on KNS uh, to improve your uh, KNS simulation and design. Thank you.